Hey everybody, Mike here. Very proud moment for me personally. So, the blue 2021 IS, the first one modified, um, originally, believe it or not, I, I really didn't have much time. There wasn't really much anything for the car. It literally was Mission Impossible. Got it done at the last minute. And it's been so well received that um, the original plan was kind of the, let's put it back to stock. Well, now it's it's it was the prototype challenge pace car, which is uh, just mind blowing to me. And I can't say enough about our Lexus USA and obviously Lexus Racing uh, for allowing me to be a part of that. And my partner is obviously has the ADV1 flow spec wheels, uh, Michelin Michelin tires. It was a Pilot Sport uh, 4S and the RSR USA prototype springs. Those springs are actually available now, the production springs. And uh, I love, I'm digging the wrap. I've been seeing a ton of people taking pictures. It's really, I think it's tastefully done. Uh, not completely wrapping the spindle, which I think was a good idea. And front and center, so it's at this corner location, which is great. I mean, a ton of people get to check it out right at the end. So, uh, again, personally a proud moment. I try not to get caught up in it. I just, you know, do. And I, I don't really reflect too much on stuff, but that was, you know, a, a, a cool moment in my personal career. And again, uh, thank you to Lexus Racing, Jeff, man, dopest dude on the planet, and, and AG, man, Vinay and these guys, Matt, and my homies, Chad and Ryan, and my homies in, in Lexus Southern, uh, you know, starting with Marcus and Tiger, and I'm dealing with uh, Sam's and, and Chris, uh, Thank you so much, you know, and, and a ton more people I probably haven't mentioned that have just been dope. Uh, Robert, Robert Bolden, it's been dope. Uh, Savvy, Paul, Paul Williamson, so many people to name. Uh, Ryan B, I mean, there's just so many people to name that allow me to be a part of this. And obviously my passion for the brand to translate into something to be embraced and showcased. So open for more stuff, I think. Nah, you're good, man. Um, even more, I think, exciting stuff is coming. Um, but yeah, this IS, if you don't know, sales have been up 80% the two months it came out without any marketing support. The marketing support started January 1st. And I think one of the big reasons is the styling. The styling is absolutely superb. I think it's the best looking car in this class. And honestly, one of the best looking sedans out. So uh, with that, refresh. And I know a lot of people are saying, oh, they'd like some, you know, see some new, new. Hopefully, you know, with, with the sales results that are happening, we'll get that. Let me go to the rear, I just realized. They also have the refresh LS. I'm gonna do a different video on this car as well. Let me get to the rear, I just realized I wasn't here. So yeah, this is at the uh, Rolex 24 here at Daytona International Speedway. It's every year in January. Let's go check it out. Make sure that you, uh, come out we have uh obviously the, the lex fest the lexus enthusiast group teamed up with uh the florida f's and i don't even know if you can hear me it's so loud here but i'm hoping you can so make sure you check it out it's the races are cool i mean there's a lot of protocols because of covid but it's a great way to get out the house get the kids out the house get some walking and experience a whole bunch of things i mean you can see Shout out to all the car brands that are here. I saw uh, the Porsche Corral and I seen BMW. You know, shout out to all of them fighting COVID for the enthusiasts and not, not giving in and not giving up. And obviously shout out to Lexus. You don't think of a brand initially as an enthusiast brand, but they are, man. They're really excited. And, and some of the new stuff I think uh, I'm hearing, you'll be excited about. I'm gonna shut this down uh, and I'm gonna do some more videos on the whole area and then this Refresh LS.